Welcome back. Daniel Q probably won't get drafted into the NFL and may never have John Elway sign him away from New England, but he'd sure love to give Elway, the Broncos, and the rest of the league an honest shot. J.P. Smallin says more. It was the chance of a lifetime for Daniel Kihu, the former all-conference lineman at Salve Regina invited to the New York Jets practice facility for a regional combine, and the 6-foot-5-inch, 310-pounder impressed, earning a spot at April's Super Regional Combine. I mean, that was just real exciting. You know, you walk into this, this facility where the Jets play, and uh, you're looking around at guys with clipboards and cameras and lights, and it's a little overwhelming at first, but then, you know, you start to say, all right, I've been ready for this, I've been training for this, and, you know, this is why I'm here. So you focus up and you get your job done. The chance coming after his agents at ATR found the Portsmouth native a spot on Team America in the Collegiate Development Football League's Euro-American Challenge, a full year after he played his last down for the Seahawks. Coming from a D3 program, I, didn't, I wasn't sure, you know, am I big enough and fast enough and strong enough, and as I kept working out, I kept getting better. I said, well, you know what, maybe I can play against ex-NFL talent, kids from those D1 farm programs that are sending kids to the NFL. And, uh, you know, at first I was a little worried I was going to be rusty, but within like the first double session, I shook off the rust and I was ready and right back in it. And I feel as though I played very well. Of the 200 or so players, of the 200 players who attended last year's Super Regional, approximately 10% signed some form of NFL contract. So Daniel's next audition at Ford Field in Detroit could be considered his final interview, one that could allow him to achieve a dream that seemed difficult to imagine when he was in high school. All 32 teams are going to be there looking, evaluating, you know, every move you make. So, I mean, I'm just right now, you got those blinders on, you know, as my agency says, you're a horse in a race. You got the blinder on, you're looking at the end goal, and you got to get there, you know, no matter what it takes, hard work. That's what I'm doing now. I know for a fact that, that he's going to give 100% effort on every play. Everybody's going to be looking at him and be like, that guy's giving it all the time, no matter what. And, and that's the only thing that we can guarantee for the NFL scouts out there is that he will give it all the time and no matter, he'll never take a play off and he'll keep coming at you. He doesn't have no in his vocabulary. He's got the heart of a lion. Um, if you look at him on film, uh, he's got the feet of a gazelle and uh, it's his drive that's going to take him to the next level. Best case scenario, I have <laughs> multiple offers from NFL teams and I get to choose from that. <laughs> that'd be that'd be amazing. With your Cardi's Furniture Superstore's hometown sports hero, I'm JP Smallins.